what is going on everybody my name is japes and welcome to episode number 94 of my path to power we are getting things started today picking up right where we left off in the team of the week cup we've got a little bit of a fitness issue here didn't realize felipe santana was down at 71 fitness so we'll give him a card i'm gonna actually leave felipe Melo at 86 fitness i don't know if that's gonna come back to bite me or not if this one would go, were to go to extra time, it could be a problem. But he's got a 3-4-3 Brazilian side and quite a bit of pace out there. And he did what many players in this tournament do. And I kind of want to talk about that. And that's instantly sub off his worst players. And he brought on Ramirez. I can't remember who else. But I don't. I want to kind of want to get your opinion on what you guys think about that. It's uh, for me. It's it's kind of a ratty move. I you know I do my best in tournaments to try to build a team that's ready for the tournament. He scores a fantastic goal there with Ramirez. A uh, lovely little bit of work from Pato, but it's one of those things where I uh, I feel like people should try to play tournaments more with the squads that they're meant to play with uh, before that. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. But Ronaldinho, 1-2 with Wellington, slips back inside and passes it into the side netting with his weaker left foot. Go on, get the ball, Ronaldinho. Let's see if we can complete this comeback from down. Two goals to nil. And that's our first one there. 60th minute. So we have plenty of time. 77th minute. Now we're on the attack yet again. And uh, for whatever reason, my passing felt a little bit off this game. I wasn't a as fluid as I was yesterday playing FIFA. It was one of those days for me yesterday. I was just on my game. But Pato gets a little bit of a break, crosses it in, and Wellington's actually going to beat Big Naldo for a header right there. And I don't know how I feel about that. I guess he got a little bit of position, and I kind of forced my way inside of him to be able to make that header. But all the same, I think Naldo stands six foot six and Wellington at five foot nine, so that's that's nine inches of difference. I don't know what that is in meters, but that's almost a foot, and that's quite substantial. But we're headed into extra time, and in extra time, he makes a huge mistake right there, and it allows me to get on the counter attack. And it's Wellington and Pato doing a nice bit of work. He stabs in with David Luiz, and that's enough space for Alexander Pato to break on by. And because it was such a close game, little LBY pass for a nice easy little nod in from Wellington 105th minute goal putting us into the lead for the first time in the match and that is exactly where we want it to be only 15 minute extra time second half of extra time left to go and we're well ahead and that is where it is going to end so three to two against you don't die and uh, I'm not quite sure if that's supposed to be you don't die or you're gonna die or how he's or how that's supposed to go but that's an interesting team name regardless of three two and we are headed on in into the finals of the Team of the Week Cup after we go out and we get a little bit of a fitness action. It took me a little while to find a squad fitness as I kind of wanted a silver one or a gold one because I had some players that were creeping down into that low 80 or mid 80 mark and plus 10 fitness would really only have gotten them up to maybe mid 90s and then I would have had to do this whole process yet again. But we eventually find a silver one. Big Alu Diara of finally sells 350 coins, uh, which is more than his discard value. So I guess that's a good thing. I've been trying to get 400 for so long, but I have to say first props to this guy using a U.S. national team for this tournament, uh, knowing that you're probably going to be coming up against Brazilian teams similar to mine. We're getting things started in the 48th minute, though, and he was a very strong player. Went for a cheeky flick over attempt with Ronaldinho. Unlucky, but it falls back to Ronaldinho. He lets me face him up, which I wouldn't recommend. Near post, OP, top net, the best net. That's a lovely strike from the legend himself. And the inform Ronaldinho is a fantastic, fantastic card on this game. Now, I haven't used the regular Ronaldinho, so I can't compare the two. But what I can tell you is the inform one is very much fun to play with. He plays a through ball into Gat, who I believe plays in the Norwegian typically again um Norwegian Tipeligan but he finds Michael Bradley and that oh my gosh that just went right through my keeper's legs in the 88th minute I could not believe it that was his second shot of the match Using Gat's pace, though, to get forward in the 4-3-3, that's what needed to be exploited. There you can see he's got the two shots in on goal, uh, but he done pretty well trying to counter against me, and that was kind of the way I knew he was going to have to play, and I think he knew he had to play. He was a very strong defender as well, using Aguchi on Yewu and Carlos Bocanegra as his center backs. Um, he had to do very well with them, but a lovely bit of work, and a fine, we eventually get Alexander Pato free in behind his defender, and that is a finish. Slaps it into the back of the net in the 101st minute to give us a two to one lead again in extra time. So we're playing a little bit more extra time than we need, than I would like to be playing. However, 
we're getting the results regardless. He tries to step inside here with Clint Dempsey. We managed to poke it away and we give it to Ronaldinho, the legend himself. He's going to be the one starting and creating this attack. Dodges one defender and is going to play Alexander Pato in on through. Early cross because I thought he was, I was kind of baiting um, on him to attack me, but we're going to play Ronaldinho in on an overlap. A lovely little bit of work and enjoy the skills. Who said I couldn't skill? I guess I suppose I've said that a few times. But from time to time, I am able to whip out the skills just like that. Lovely goal from Ronaldinho, sealing the deal. Two goal lead at this point in the 117th minute. And that is a fantastic goal to end the tournament on. We're going to take the victory at 3-1 in this one. Wanted to say thank you guys for your support on my video yesterday. Uh, it was absolutely incredible. I do apologize for not getting a stream going. I kept DCing from head-to-head -head games and I couldn't get on the Ultimate Team servers. So it kind of created a bit of... Of a problem, but uh, I wanted to apologize for that. Stay tuned to my Facebook and my Twitter to know when I will be streaming next. 10,000 coins is mine. Thank you all for watching. My name is Japes, and I will catch you all next time.